Chris Sheridan here with Enom. We're at HostingCon 2013, and we're joined by Simon Anderson, CEO of DreamHost. Simon, hey, thanks Chris. for joining us today. Absolutely. Appreciate yeah, it. Fun. Um, we're going to talk about new TLDs today, but I wanted to start off by getting a little background about DreamHost for everybody from you. So DreamHost is a web hosting and now cloud computing company, okay. and we serve the world's entrepreneurs and developers, which includes creatives, artists, and so on. So we have almost 400,000 customers worldwide, and uh, it's everything from domain registration through blogs, websites, and then just a place for them to develop and test applications and then and then actually run applications, web and mobile applications online. What do you guys think of, you know, the impact new TLDs are gonna have? You know, we just found out that it'll probably be end of Q3, early Q4, they start going live. You know, what's DreamHost's opinion on new TLDs? So I think TLDs are a really important way of expressing, um, you know, your website, your unique location on the internet, but that's become so much more now than just a website or a blog. What do you think, your, how do you think your customers are gonna respond? Well, we're already getting a bit of a window into it because we've implemented, as you know, the watch list that, right. that you guys have um, have, have set up and, and for us, which is fantastic. And so we've actually seen from the expressions of interest on the watch list that there's there's very high interest, for example, in .app. Right. And so the things we expect there, just looking you know, at that is, there's gonna be a lot of utilization of .app for new web applications as distinct from .com. Um, right. And so we think that's an area that, that, that customers are gonna go. .blog as well as another very popular um, GTLD yes. you know, yeah. in our sphere, .web and so on. So there's a, there's a whole range of options for them. From an innovation perspective, I think what we really wanna do is, is give um, our customers the ability to take advantage of you know, any new product or service like this and, and put it out there in a way that makes it very consumable and, that, and very sure. searchable and findable. So you know, I think to some extent we're really going to be leveraging the partnership that we have with, with Enom yeah. to, uh, to be able to put in front of customers sort of user experience around how do I find these domains that are relevant to me. Right. Um, right. You know, not only during the watch list period, but then once once the domains are actually out there, that's going to be very, very important. So we're looking forward to hopefully innovating together yeah. on that front and learning from your expertise and sharing, you know, more about our customer base to, to help to build that, you know, that really ideal user experience. 